Let's take a look at Coefficient's new Pivot Table Builder, powered by GPT, to analyze this sample contact list import. Here we have a number of basic contact fields like name, age, traffic source, email, as well as information about whether or not the contact registered for a recent event and how much they've spent with our business to date. For our first pivot table, let's analyze the data by traffic source. We can use a prompt for each traffic source, show number and percentage of registrations in 2022. And there we are, we can see we have one row for each traffic source and we have an aggregation of count of names as well as percentage of count of names. If I open the pivot table settings, we can see coefficient has also automatically added a date filter where registration date is within 2022. Next up, let's see if we can get coefficient to aggregate our contact, uh, first contacted date field by year and quarter. To do that, we can use the prompt. For each first contact date, year and quarter, show percentage of contacts that registered. And here we go, we can see there is one row for each year quarter combination in order. And we have columns showing true or false for the registered field. Finally, let's get an aggregation by both country and region so that we have a drill down pivot table. Here we'll use the prompt, show average and max spending by country and region. We'll exclude null countries and we'll order from largest to smallest by average spending. And here we are. We can see we have two groupings of rows, both country and state region, which allows us to easily drill down by the country or state level. And for each country and state, we can see the max of spending as well as the average of spending. And we can clearly see that all of the countries and states are ordered uh, from largest to smallest by average. If I open our pivot table settings, we can also see that a filter has been applied so that null or blank countries are automatically excluded. Hope you enjoy this feature and that it saves you time building your next pivot tables.